A critical study from very close quarters of Sir Chief Gabriel Osawarik Benedion's life reveals unequivocally that he is imbued with a lot of passion and love for humanity. This cannot be overstated. When it comes to his family, nuclear, immediate and generations of his extended family, he goes the whole hog to pamper them with unparalleled love and care. Sir Chief Gabriel Gunnarion places the issues of his family over and above any other thing. Therefore, he is ready to break the rules to make them comfortable. Right from the beginning, Sir Chief Gabriel Osawari Gunnarion sacrificed a lot, even when life was tough for him, to see that the foundation of the education of his children was built on a very strong pedestal so it can stand the test of time. He made sure that they were all enrolled in the best schools, from the elementary, secondary to tertiary levels, both locally and internationally, where they received the best training in learning and shaping of character to place them in vantage positions to make the best use of the opportunities that come their way in the future. Today, Sir Gabriel Osawari Benedong is reaping a very rich dividend in the big investment he devoted to the education of the children, not counting the cost. All his children and grandchildren have risen to the pinnacles of their different professions as lawyers, architects, engineers and international businessmen and women, positively projecting the name of the family globally in their various dealings. The poster figure for the Gabriel Osawari Benedion clan is Chief Lucky Nasahare Benedion, who was the executive governor of Edo State for eight years. In the realms of politics too, the Benedion family can boast of Honorable Omosede Benedion, who represented Ovia Northeast Federal Constituency of Edo State at the House of Representatives. Sir Chief Gabriel Osawari Benedion, the Esama of Benin Kingdom, who has since become a great grandfather, is the proud grandfather of a young lady, Osazu Igbenedong, daughter of former governor Lucky Igbenedong, the presenter of Osazu Show on African Independence Television AIT, who is making very solid waves in Nigeria's broadcasting space. Osazu Igbenedong, who is likened by Nigerians to globally acclaimed television presenter and interviewer, is also a philanthropist like her grandfather. Osazu Igbenedion demonstrated uncommon humanitarian selflessness with her magnanimous donations of palliatives to orphanages in the suburb of Abuja to cushion the effect of the COVID-19 pandemic on some Nigerians. The young lady, Osazu Igbenedion, has also on her own organized and bankrolled symposia and seminars that have brought together key players in the different spheres of the Nigerian economy to seek for solutions to burning national issues from time to time. Many generations of the Sir Gabriel Osawari Benedion's dynasty, especially the younger ones, are high flyers in their different areas of calling. They are all working assiduously to meet, match and surpass the enviable records of their father and grandfather, whose legacies of hard work, integrity, honesty and respect for everyone they all have taken as a daily learning curve to become world beaters in every aspect, like the living legend and patriarch of the family, Sir Gabriel Osawari Benedion, the Esama of Benin Kingdom. When it comes to the marriage of all his children and grandchildren, Sir Gabriel Benedion is the most ideal parent for all suitors. Sir Gabriel Benedion never interferes in the choice of the prospective wives and husbands of his children and grandchildren. Is physically here. You can see his hands are complete. 
the right hand all the five fingers. Yes. The legs are complete. Yes. The head is complete. Yes. This is my son. The Igunigan family is a predominantly Christian family from Edo State in the south-south part of Nigeria. Most of the children and grandchildren of Sir Gabriel Osawa Igunigan are married to people from outside Edo State and the Muslim faith. Almighty Allah, we thank you for this great day. We thank you for bringing us to this wonderful family, this noble family. This family of royalty. This family that has made Nigeria great. We thank you for bringing Nigerians from across the nooks and crannies of this nation. We thank you for bringing the south and the north together. We thank you for bringing Christians and Muslims together. We thank you for promoting peace and tranquility in our nation through this marriage. Lord Almighty, we are here to take the best of the best from the best of the families of Nigeria. We thank you for showing us this place. And we assure you that we will do our best to ensure that we give her the best that she gets from the best of the best. Thank you, Lord. Omar, is this horrible, sir? You are satisfied? What? Chiefs, ladies and gentlemen, Omar has finally picked. I've finally seen the girl she has been looking for. <laughs> Indeed, the children and grandchildren of the Igbenegion dynasty are following in the cosmopolitan attribute of Sir Gabriel Osawar Igbenegion, who is also married to Lady Cherry Igbenegion from Jamaica. Among their spouses are Yorubas, Igbos, those from the south-south and indeed northern part of Nigeria.
This way. And this way. I, the word. 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 It is a token of my love for you. It is a token of my love. <coughs> it is a token of my faith. It is a token of my faith. And I release my love. I release my love. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 And so with this ring, with this ring, I the word. I give you as a token of my faith. I believe with all my heart that this is forever. It is my love and my faith that I release now. In Jesus' name. Amen. Both Gadi and Ewemade are now husband and wife in the name of God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. And stars go on each And Sir Gabriel Igbenedion, who enjoys the full unflinching support of his amiable consult, Lady Cherry Igbenedion, has always gone the extra mile to show the strong love they have for their children, not stopping at any expense at all to pull off a very well-organized event with groundbreaking attendance of the high and mighty from all corners of Nigeria and beyond. This is a veritable platform for the friends of the Benedion family at home and abroad to also show camaraderie and conviviality with the Benedions, who have also been there for them when the occasion called for it in the past. The Benedions have organized marriages all over the world, South Africa, the United Kingdom and so on with very impressive attendance of friends and family members from different parts of the world. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I come, take this ring, as the sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Take you on a catch to be my lawfully wedded wife, to love and to hold, to love and to hold. in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, for rich and for poor, until death does part. To her, I on a catch take you at home. To be my lawfully wedded husband, to love and to hold, in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, for rich and for poor, until this last part.
Bible that God ordained for everybody here by the grace of God. Every problem in your life will come down to level zero. Level zero. Level zero. In the name of Jesus. Did they got it? Oh, ladies and gentlemen, they pass this time. Please a round of applause for them. Okay. Uh-huh. Oh, oh my gosh. It's so cute. Ladies and gentlemen, our boy is talking. He's speaking our language. Please a round of applause for this gentleman. But it's still an honor to be here to celebrate the newlywed. So please, um, I wish them all the best and may their love be modern enough to, to survive the times and be old fashioned enough to last to forever. So please, raise your glasses. <laughs> so please, raise your glasses and toast to the new Mr. and Mrs. Ingrinate. <laughs> better coming home to a lovely wife. Have your routine. My father used to always say in the old days, any business after nine o'clock is illegal business. Go home. Go home to your wife. Have that structure. Um, we are here as witnesses. We can't live their life. You have to live their life for yourself. Uh, God has placed the two of you coming from two beautiful homes. That's right. All you need to do is to settle down and live your life. Cut your coat according to your size. The, your parents are there to help you grow. But the struggle is between the two of you. The road is between the two of you. Nobody is going to interfere. God has placed the two of you already. It was not easy for anybody. The reckoning of Visa would have to take more time to have it. I'm glad you all are here. God will turn up back safely. Amen. 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 Lady C, you're a darling. And every other person as well as the Otunfo. Sir, appreciate your coming as well. And all the dignitaries, and I might not know your names, but God bless you all for coming. And thank you very much. As well as my in-laws. My father-in-law is a G. <laughs> and like TSM, my mother-in-law is a super chick. <laughs> so, as well as other guests of Bowery, thank you all for coming. And you all have a lovely evening. This is celebrating Sir Gabriel Osawari Benedion, the Esama of Benin Kingdom, the quintessential father, doting husband, unparalleled organizer of the home, and an exemplary family man to the core.